Welcome to another fun-filled episode of Fat Bike Television. I'm Sven. And I'm your Uncle Goins. Today we're taking a look at the Sarma Vortex. This is a new bike from Sarma. It's a $14.99 retail starting point aluminum framed fat bike. $14.99 for the base model. Base model. We have some upgrades on this. Yeah, and you know, a little bit about Sarma. We've known about them for a couple of years. They were traditionally a carbon company when they started out. Right. And in an effort to get lower pricing, how the heck did they do that? $14.99? Really? They went consumer direct. Ah, they cut out the middleman. So they will ship this bike. In fact, my mail carrier brought me this bike in a big giant box. Not your female carrier? <laughs> my female mail carrier. Female mail, female mail carrier. Uh, brought this right to my door and uh, we put it together. It's an aluminum frame. It's a hydroformed aluminum frame, so that's what gives it all those sexy shapes. Um, 6061 triple butted tubing. They take and file all of those welds nice and smooth to make it that, almost gives it that carbon look. Smooth. And a nice matte black powder coat on it with some pretty dynamic graphics that kind of Sarma is known for. Right. Uh, keeping with the frame specs here a little bit, it's got a 197 rear axle spacing. And a 150 front spacing with through axles. And this <gasps> is, right? <laughs> Uh, this is one of the upgrades to the stock bike that they sent our test bike with, the Bluto fork with new push button action. Yeah, absolutely. The other upgrade, 100 millimeter Sarma Naran double wall carbon rims mounted to the stock V tire snowshoe XLs, not the two XLs, which are 505. These are the 4.7 XLs. And these should go tubeless very easily. And you tubes in there now. You ran these rims tubeless, didn't you? Not yeah. this particular set, but this right. rim. That was the first set of wheels that I successfully ran tubeless. Yeah, I ran. I, I still am running the 80 millimeter uh, Narans. I like the rim for sure, and they do set up tubeless real nicely. Uh, uh, going on with the uh, drivetrain on this one, it's uh, kind of a tried and true SRAM. Uh, derailleur setup with an X9 uh, clutch style derailleur back there and an X7 up here. It's a 2x10 with kind of a house brand crank and uh, that saves you a little bit of money there. We've got Avid DB3 hydro brakes front and rear. Stop and stop. Ooh, those feel nice. And a very nice WTP saddle. It's a Silverado, kind of a narrower profile than the Rocket V. Mounted to a Sarma carbon seat post, which is pretty sweet. Pretty nice. Up front, we've got uh, basic aluminum bars and stem. Some stacky things in there. Those are yeah. nice, too, to kind of stack you up a little bit. Those are Sarma brand Those are not components. Sarma branded. So we'd say house, house brand components. And uh, this bike, we do not know, with the upgrades, what this bike would retail for. So we're going to have to put that in the show notes. It's a couple good upgrades on there. Yeah. This bike is going to go up into our test matrix. We don't really know who's going to test it either. We don't know we anything. We don't know a lot. <laughs> we're, we're just two crazy guys with a white background in right. a world of snow. Hey, we've got snow in the forecast. I'm doing sob now. <laughs> it's, uh, you want to hear the, the freewheel? It goes buzz. Yep, that's pretty sweet. So I think maybe Angry Andy is yeah. going to test ride this bike. Well, one of the things that we uh, we got to mention is you know when you're buying Consumer Direct, sizing is an issue. So make sure you look over the specs. This one ends up being a little bit larger than we would expect for that sized frame, uh, specifically in the standover and just a couple other things. It's just a little bit bigger than you'd expect when ordering a 19-inch frame. Absolutely. Maybe it's all the bigness. In four to six weeks, we're going to have a review of this bad mamma jamma. So tune in then. Until then, you can check out the website that Greg's going to put in right here. Whoop. Like magic. You might put it over here. Or down here. Oh, well. It Until then, somewhere. we're going to say goodbye. Have a great day. Showing you my armpits. Bye. <laughs>